finally coming in, so it's going to be uh, it's crazy. It's been 20 years. I'm excited and um, it's fun. It's a very emotional night, so we'll see what happens. Dave told us you would ask him to catch the first pitch, but he said, I'm afraid to let Let's go. Yes, I mean, I wish he would catch it, but I, you know, I think he doesn't understand my strikes. So I'm going to get my first strike today, hopefully. But no, it's just, just to be here, it's, a, you know, it's an amazing honor just to be part of the Dodger history. And it's awesome. Just to be honored today is just very humbling. Like when you walked back in, did you kind of feel a flood of emotion? Yes, every time. Every time I step on this field, it's like it's, it's like a church to be. Like it's like my office on top of that little man. I'm walking here with all the history. Like, to me, just to be part of that history is just, uh, it's not realistic. I don't really, I still don't feel it. Like, I tell my kids, my kids are be here today, so just to be part of that history is very humble. All four kids? One of them. One of them is his girlfriend. My other ones were earlier, like my son Arlie came in last week for a dog. Chance to see it, so now I get my old son. You got a killer team, you played a lot of golf or what up? A lot of golf, yes, of course, that's kind of what I do. A lot of golf, a lot of bicycle. Yeah, you look good as a fiddle. Trying, trying. I mean, now I have time to do take care of myself, so it's easier. I try not to talk about him so much like a god because it's like it's really weird to see that someone dominates and doing like doing things that I thought I was really special in doing and having him doing this as a hitter as a pitcher is pretty impressive. I mean I don't know how to explain it, but for me to see him live and hear the ball off the bat and see his throw was fucking amazing.
question. Who's Papa Maruki? Papa Maruki was great. He's happy now, but he was he was doing a lot of it's hard. It's like it's a lot of emotions. Like you get in here, you haven't been here in a while. I'm the pitching man. All the fans and everybody else. And they may not appreciate whatever it means. It's surreal. It's something that's very special. We take it for granted. We're playing. We're we're here. Like we just go through a routine every single day, but. Like for me, having all the biggest like thing in the world, like the biggest thing in baseball, like being part of that organization, that's one of the biggest brand you can ever think of, the Dodgers and the top three. So yeah. to me to be part of that is... Really, that was incredible. So was it something that you did a lot of the jungle on the radio or whatever? Like, tell me, what's your favorite memory? Yeah, I get goosebumps. It's kind of weird. Like, I like the Dodgers Stadium. There's really nothing in the world like it. Just showing up with all the family here on the Dodgers Friends. Being so aggressive and trying to enjoy the moment a little more. So it does remind me a lot of like when I came in and the fans gave me all that extra energy to get on the mound. And I even know like you have all those little eggs and pains. The adrenaline rush that the fans gave me is for me and my dad. Like, song was actually a mistake. Well, not a mistake, but it was something that I was a starter and I was in my trial when Guns N' Roses and the Bell got hurt. 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 They were really nice to Montreal, and that was a good memory. Save your money now. You never know what they're going to cost. Thank you guys so much, the Hurricane family. That was a start of the season. We love hearing these stories. I mean, there's been seasons like this year for so long, so to hear the back, the history of all this is really cool.